mistaken point. Around us, mist. Underfoot, petrified deep time rises in welts to prod our souls here and there, breaking into sudden bar relief. Eighty-eight percent of Earth's history is called the Precambrian Age. Mistaken Point is the only World Heritage Site for that vast span of time at the moment. What's so important about the reserve is that these fossils, they're the first large, complex, multicellular organisms known in the history of life. The main fossil site is absolutely amazing. Our particular sequence of rocks here is between 580 and 560 million years ago. They're preserved on the upper surfaces of the beds as uh, imprints. You're walking uh, across what once was a deep sea ocean floor. It's quite amazing, as, as one person has said, it's like you're almost scuba diving over this very strange deep sea ecological community. And the question arises, why did they evolve in, in that type of environment? So there are many unanswered questions. When you're physically in mistaken point, you can feel the power of the wind, you can see the crashing of the rocks. You can almost use your imagination to imagine the immensity of the power that it took to thrust the ocean floor up onto the land. I think I'll always be making work about Mistaken Point. I have such a, a strong attachment to that place. When I'm working on the surface of the things and I'm running it through the machine, I'm just building layers and layers and layers. To think about 575, you know, a million years, like, it's just uh, so ancient that uh, I can't even imagine. What I can do as an artist is try to translate that deep time and that the passage of time in the layering of the work. Back here, in the Anthropocene, the mist is thickening to drizzle. The bedrock darkens, deepening the contrast. What shall we call this antique frond? Part fern, part feather, part art nouveau and brand new braille, urgent and enigmatic as an oracle. <laughs>